I got two coffee mugs with me, one from Ember and another one from Oham. These are some of the high-end coffee mugs. They both can heat up your coffee or your tea for a period of time, but they do it differently. First of all, let me start off with the build of this coffee mugs. This one, the Ember, is made up of kind of like a metal aluminium piece, but um, it don't feel like that to be honest. I only pretty much noticed that when I kind of like hit it. Or sometimes like even like um, hit it towards my teeth right when I'm sipping the coffee and this one is pretty much a ceramic mug just like any other mug and uh yes it's very breakable so if you drop it it's gonna break <laughs> pretty much the both comes with a coaster that does two different stuff as well this one is more so like a charger this is the amber one and this is pretty much like a hidden plate right this one also can charge your phone. You can also use this as a wireless charger for your phone or any electronic device. I have that capability, right? So that's pretty much about the coasters. And let's get to the main differences of the two mugs, right? As you can tell just by the coasters, you can pretty much guess the probably the differences between these. So the main difference really with this two mug is how the heat up your drink. This one has a battery in it. So when you charge it from the coaster all right and that's a battery that holds power and with that power you can hit up the drink and you don't have to have this sitting on the coaster all the time for you to have like a heated drink right unless like if the battery is not charged then you can place it on the coaster it charges the battery while hitting up the drink as well but this one is just like a regular mug so you just put it on the heat plates and heat up the drink the disadvantage with this one is because it's just a hidden mug you only have like one specific temperature all the time that the drink is going to be but with the ember one it actually comes with an app that lets you customize your temperature you can move it like as high as you want as low as you want and it have like different settings as well for different like type of beverages like tea black tea cream tea or like dark coffee however you want your drink to be this one gives you that flexibility the last difference is this one comes with a cover lead so pretty much you can cover your beverage and it also comes with a filter as well for like your tea or like if you want to look like a coffee brew a filter you can pour your leaf in or your coffee bean coffee grind but um, i don't have that anymore so yes that's pretty much the difference between these two coffee mugs um i like them both and i like the way they do this stuff differently if i have to choose which one I like most would be this one, the Amber. I've had this for like almost two years now. Still working fine, very much. The only problem that I actually do have with this is the charging coaster, right? Time to time it goes bad, like the pins, cause I got like two pins in it that kind of like sits on the two rings on the charge, on the mug. And once these things go bad, you're gonna have to replace this thing in order for you to use this stuff. That's the only problem with it, right? And that's why I actually went ahead and picked up this one because this one does that differently. So if I, in case this thing goes bad, then I may just continue using this, right? Because this charger apparently is uh, super expensive as well. I think they're like 50 bucks uh, from their website when I was looking them up. But I was able to fix it, so that's a plus for me. But yeah, that's pretty much about these two coffee mugs. And I hope I helped you answer your question i was looking online to actually for reviews about these two mugs but i couldn't find any so i was like all right why not let me just do it right so yes and if you decide of picking up one let me know in the comments below which one you like be better and please hit the like button if you found value in this video check out my other videos as well i do lots of videos like this reviews and diys vlogs travel vlogs inspirational content browse more stuff thanks again and i'll catch you guys on the next one Peace out.